guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Samantha Rizondo. If you haven't been here before, and if you have, welcome back. Oh my God, in front of me, I have a holiday slash Black Friday haul. I know I'm very delayed, but I'm here now, so please forgive me. Um, so yeah, this is everything that I have. There's a lot, she's full. Um, so we're gonna go through it all. And I'll let you know where I bought it, why I bought it, and who I bought it for, me. <laughs> so yeah, I got a mixture of holiday limited edition sets, and then I got my Black Friday sales as well. So because I'm in Australia, Black Friday sales from America, they took a while. I've actually had these for a few weeks, but if you've never been here before, I just moved houses. So I've got a new little setup, and I just didn't want to mess anything up. I didn't want to open the boxes and then lose it all until I did this video. So here we are, and I'm going to start, I'll start with things that I got for holiday, shall I? Look, I've got a mixture of things. It's a haul and a haul and a haul, if you could say. Um, so I'm going to start with, I bought a couple Morphe products. This is um, the Big Prime, it's the Lash Primer. And it's really interesting to me. I haven't even opened it yet, but here we are. It is blue. I think the idea is to make the black blacker with this blue primer. I'm very intrigued and I can't wait to use it. And I hope it gives length. Condition, oh, it preps your lashes for larger than life volume, amplifies the effect and color intensity. So yeah, that's what I thought. Very cool. And then I bought the Morphe 2 Brow Crush Tinted Brow Gel. Oh, I wanna know what this is like, like right now. I'm so curious. I got the shade Medium Brown. Oh, I love the tiny little brush. Okay. Tiny is a bit too dark, but I think I can get away with it. You know what my problem is? I'm in between blonde and brown. Yeah, that's quite nice. Perfect. Next, oh, look, I got a few things from Morphe, didn't I? This was the brush last 10 piece eye brush set and bag. Now, I'll be honest with you, there is a one reason why I bought this whole set. And it's one of the brushes. Here you are. This little silicon one. It for packing on glitters or intense shades. That's why I really wanted it. But also they're all really tiny brushes and I got hooded eyes. So all these like really tiny ones are beneficial for me. Like these three in particular, actually these four in particular are really good for me. So that's why I bought this set and it feels, the quality feels better than their regular Morphe brushes that you buy individually. Because I'm not a huge fan of the individuals, but these felt so much softer. Um, so I'm very happy with that. And I actually love this little bag. So we actually got free from work. The Briogeo Detox Restore and Protect Hair Care Kit. How cute. I am so happy to have this. So what do I get? <clears throat> I've used a lot of these products. <gasps> Farewell Frizz Blow Dry Perfection Heat Protecting Cream. Oh, I don't have anything like that. Need that. Deep conditioning mask, can't have enough. And scalp revival shampoo, need this because I'm a dandruff gal. It's gross, I know, but it's just who I am. And then from the um, Mecca Boxing Day sale, that's the one, I got the NARS Velvet Lip Glide in the shade Swing and they go for $19. They went for $19, this shade is so pretty. And they're so buttery smooth, but they kind of dry down matte. It's like very comfortable to wear, but it's not shiny. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm so glad I got it. And then I got a skincare. And my God, the value in this skincare set is insane. This is the LMS Pro Collagen at Perfect Partners. Okay, so the price of this whole thing was, okay, this is, Full size and it retails for $200 and this retail as a set for like $160. So you, this was cheaper than just buying this. And this is full size. I think this is smaller, but it doesn't even matter. I did buy it for the cleansing balm. 
I've always wanted. Oh, what's this? Face towel. Oh, it did not say. Oh, it does say that. <laughs> okay, I didn't know I had that. That's so cute. Love that. And so I think this is smaller. It's still big though. And has any of you ever tried the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm? They have other cleansing balms, but this one is the best one. Oh, so good. I can't wait. I have other things I need to use before this. And then this Pro Collagen Marine Cream. I've actually never used this, but I've heard pretty good things. <sighs> Let's give this a try. Oh my God, I'm so excited to have this. What well, feels really nice and light. Oh, it's a bit scented. That's a bit scented for me. Anti-wrinkle day cream. Marine cream, it does feel very light and water-like, so, but it's still hydrating. So that's exciting. Oh, I was so excited to get that. And then, oh, oh my God. So this big one here is, got my address on it, so let's not look too much into it. I have opened it, but I haven't like looked into it. So this is KBD Vegan Beauty. I bought, oh my God, what did I buy? I'll tell you what I bought. I got a lot of stuff in here. So they were having a 40% off site-wide sale. And then they had a mystery bag with a full face. You just tell them what shade you are. And that was already, the mystery bag was already discounted. And then I got 40% off that. So I basically got a full face of products that I don't know that I have for like 50 US dollars for a full face, wasn't it? Yeah. And then I got some other things as well. So I really went ham with this brand because I don't know anything about them. The only thing I've ever tried from them is their new eye primer and the tattoo liner, which I thought was okay, but. So what it came with, oh my God. Did I get, oh, okay. So, um, you guys don't know, but I'm making a little um, giveaway box of gifts. And I'm just gonna quickly show you this. I'll keep it in, or oh, I might keep it in the packaging. I got to select a, um, some free items as well as all the discount. So I was gonna put this little bag in it. I've got a million makeup bags. So I don't need it, but I'm making a little collection. And when I hit 2000 subscribers, then I will do a big giveaway. And I'm telling you it's a good one. I'm telling you it's a good one. Like nice, some nice high end products. So I'm gonna put that in the giveaway. It looks like I got another makeup bag. So let's start, I'm just gonna have to go in and just because there's things that I definitely ordered, but... Oh, this was another freebie. The Studded Kiss Lipstick Cream in Lovecraft. Let me see if I like this shade. I think I might have intended this for a giveaway. So it's a little mini. I'm not gonna keep that. I'm gonna put that in the giveaway. I just have like a gazillion lipsticks. So let's pop that in there as well. I got um, a little... Uh, Mirror. They gave you like so many freebies. Oh, it just looks like this. So there's no lid on it or anything. But that's cute. I'll put that in my bag. Yes. I shall keep it in this little sleeve. Don't, I don't really need that, do I? I don't know. I need to think about it. Okay, then I got... This was part of the mystery bag because I had to pick my shade. This is the True Portrait Liquid to Powder Foundation in Light 4. I have no idea what this is like. I've never seen reviews. I don't know. I'll shake well. Squeeze to dispense a small drop and blend with fingers. A little goes a, little goes a long way. So let's see. Oh, she's very watery. I'm definitely going to have to try that on my face because I don't know. It feels weird. 
packaging is cute though so I got that and I'll show you that stuff that I actually picked and ordered so this is all my mystery bag stuff in here so I actually got another bag I don't need that either okay then we have liquid lipstick oh in razzle I mean, oh, what the hell? Hmm. Whoa. Look at that. That's so bright. I actually think I would wear that. Oh, I do not have a shade like that. That is sick, see? It's probably not a popular shade, that's why they put it in here, but like, I think I would wear that. Yes, okay. I'm down for that. I am down for that. Then we have the Ink Liner Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner in Trooper Black. Okay. Where's the um, tattoo liner? Is it different? What's the difference? I don't know, but that's cool. Then I got v Vinyl Lip Cream in Lolita. Oh, this shade looks nice. It's actually, you know why I'm gonna open it. It's actually quite nice. It's this one down here. Oh, it smells so nice. Okay, that feels really nice. So I'll keep that. Well, I have to now. I've touched it. Then we've got the Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. Another one in Bruno. Why is there an animal on here? Oh, 5% of the retail price goes to Farm Sanctuary. Oh, I don't think I'd wear this shade. This is like a blue purple. I prefer like a pinky purple. I don't know, would I wear this? I don't know. So then we have the Go Big or Go Home Volumizing Mascara. That's pretty cool. Oh my God, this is massive. That's massive. I'm not gonna open that either because I don't wanna get air in it and dry it out. But I will definitely keep this, that's very cool. And then the last thing in the mystery bag is the uh, Everlasting Blush in Rosebud. This looks beautiful. I'll definitely keep this. Ooh, I like this color. Let's give this a, oh, that feels so, oh yeah. That's beautiful, that feels so soft. Feels so soft, it almost feels creamy. Oh, that's beautiful, oh. Lovely. And then, sorry, I forgot, it also came, which is why kind of like the clinger for me, why I bought the mystery bag, is I wanted this foundation brush and it came with it basically for free because I think these retail for like 38 or 40 bucks or something like that. So I did very well getting all of that for 50 US dollars. I like trying things I wouldn't normally um, think to try, like this lip color. I probably would never have picked that out, but now that I see it, it's beautiful. Oh, double packaged. Beautiful. Oh, yes. I'm, um, you'll see in my next package, I bought some brushes. I've been in a bit of a brush phase lately in the last few months. Oh, this is cute. Oh, I'm happy I got that. What I actually bought is two more things. Oh, did you see that? I bought, this is the main reason I bought anything from Kat Von D. No, don't say that. KVD Vega Beauty, sorry. The con Shade Light Contour Palette. Mate, this is something I've always wanted. Always wanted. But I never bought it. And, and then she went a little bit cray cray. So oh, it tells me how I have a slim face. I don't know if that's going to work. <laughs> So here we have the palette. I got the light one, obviously. And I don't think I'll be able to use this shade, but I think I can use all of these bronzer contour shades and this one, but maybe not these two. Anyway, I'm very excited for this. I love contour. I'm one of those people that just loves a good contour. I don't go ham on it, but I love how it just like chisels my chubby cheeks. And then lastly, I got something that's actually new, and this is the Edge of Reality Eyeshadow Palette. The fully recyclable one. The only thing I'm like is, who really finishes an eyeshadow palette, you know? So 
So he's going to throw the whole thing out. Oh, the silk is very good quality. And the packaging is stunning. Can you see that? Oh, that looks so pretty. That looks really pretty. And let me, this shade looks like a duochrome. Oh my God, it is. Oh. Can you see? Oh, that's pretty. What else have we got? Let's do this gold. Oh my God, they feel so good. Oh my God, they feel so good. And let's do this red. They are pretty. Very happy. Oh, I'm excited to give that a try. It's very light. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, then I got one more package. By the way, I have not bought anything in a while. <laughs> and I don't think I will buy anything in a while because I just went a little bit crazy at Boxing Day. I will mention I bought um, two mystery bundles from Enchanted Lustre cosmetics the australian indie brand but i still haven't received it but i mean i knew that was going to happen because it's like a four to six week wait because she makes them herself it takes a while um so i'll probably do a video later on that showing the mystery bags that i got and my last box is shigma they had a 40 percent off sale too when i did my um a holiday what I'm going to buy in holiday video, I was like, I won't do anything less than 40%. <laughs> and I did. I did Kat Von D. Oh, I'm so sweaty. I did Kat Von D and Sigma, and they were both 40% off site wide. So I stuck to my guns, stuck to my word. I did so well in this Sigma sale. Oh. And I got a free brush. Whee! Should I just show you the granddaddy first? I think I just will. I bought this eyeshadow palette I've been wanting for so long. And I'm so glad that I waited. <gasps> it's got a velvet. The Sigma Untamed. Now, to me, this is very similar to, like, it's my version of the subculture, which I do not own. <gasps> the packaging is so beautiful. Do you see that velvet? <laughs> Look. And it comes with a brush, and it's a Sigma brush. Damn, okay. Look at this beautiful palette. Oh my God. I'm so excited to use this. Let's go <gasps> this pretty pink. Envy, like green. Oh, let's go the mustard. I'm gonna go the mustard. Oh my God. And then let's go. There's another purpley shade I want to look. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. Oi! I'm so excited. And then I bought. Oh, yes! I'll show you my brushes last. Of course, I bought brushes. I have to buy brushes. I got this um, tint and tame brow gel in clear. I bought, I bought some brow gels because I'm trying to find my holy grail. So this is just clear. Oh, that looks good. Mm, I can't wait to use that. Got a mixture of tinted and clear, which is what I've been wanting. And then I got this eyeshadow base primer in Persuade. I've heard very good things about Sigma base primer. Let's have a look. Oh, that's a little bit more tinted than I thought it was going to be. Let's see how it blends out. Yeah, that could be okay. It's just a little bit pinker than I thought. But I'm excited to give that a go. And then I got three brushes. One of them was free. I don't know which one was free. I think it might be the bake. I don't think I would have bought a baking brush. I bought all face brushes. Because that's what I needed. Okay, so this is the F89 Bake Kabuki but definitely still a foundation situation. Oh, that's nice. Then we have the F47 Multitasker. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, that's so soft and beautiful. So Multitasker, obviously, you can use for multiple reasons. Blush, bronzer, foundation, or whatever you're into. And then lastly, I've got the F82 Round Kabuki, which is the one that I wanted the most. 
I'm really looking for some good foundation brushes. I'm not totally in love with the one that I have. And I wanted more of a round topped one, so I'm very glad that I got this one. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I can't wait to use these beautiful brushes. Oh my God. So that, yeah, that's everything. <laughs> I've got so much more new makeup. See, this is what happens when you finish your project pen. You're like, ah, I finished so much makeup this year. I can buy so much more. I think I'm gonna stop buying makeup for a little bit. Um, I'm happy with everything that I have at the moment. And I want to finish some products. So like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're new here. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.